Now I'm going to show you how to add uh, sample, uh, embedded, embedded images inside a post or a page. Okay, so what we're going to do is I'm just going to create a little bit of text so that this is going to look alright. So we have a nice long paragraph there. Okay, so, okay, I'll show you just adding a featured image. I can just upload a featured image there and wait for it to load. Set the featured image. So that's the featured image. But what if I want to put a, an image inside a post? Okay, what I do first is in that you can do it in the visual editor or text editor. I prefer to use a text editor. So I'm going to select where I want the image to start. Now it doesn't matter if you want the image on the right, the left or the centre. You've got to select on the left hand side. And then what you do is you click add media. Okay, and I'm going to use an image I just uploaded. And you'll see I've got these options now. When I've selected that image, I've got a line. I'm going to align this to the right. Okay, I don't. You can have the the image linked to a page. You can put a custom URL or whatever, or you can have it linked to the file. But I'm going to have it linked to nothing. And I'm going to make the image a medium sized image because I don't. I want it to just sit nicely on the right hand side. So what I do is I click. I've set all this up correctly. You should name the image. So uh, if it was a picture of me, I'd say Peter Ritchie. Um, I go by the. Peter J. Ritchie, because my dad's name is Peter Ritchie as well. Um, and you can put some alt text in, so when you put your mouse over the, the, the image, uh, the alt text will appear. And you can also have a, camage, uh, a, a, a caption. Okay, in WordPress, I'd say on WordPress. Okay, all right. You could also have a description if you want to, but that's not that necessary. But that's good for SEO, okay? Now I'm gonna insert the image in the post. Now you'll notice, that, there it is, there it jumps in there, okay? Now when I actually look at the visual editor, you'll see it's positioned on the right hand side. It's got the, the, the text and all that in there. See how it's nicely positioned? Okay, so now what we're gonna do is I'm gonna show you actually how to embed a file. So we've got the image in there, and now we wanna put in a, a, like a Word document or a PDF file. So I'm gonna show you how to do that now. Okay, so again, you select the area. Okay, you might make that, that a file, but Let's just stick with this at the moment. Okay. Now I'm going to put, I'm going to upload a file now. Select from there the file. So I'm going to go to the desktop. I'm going to look for this Olympus. Oops, it's too big for that. So hang on a second. You'll have a file file maximum file size uh, for that. I'm going to put in one of my client one of my designers invoices. Okay. So what I've done is I've. You, you notice I selected that area in the post and I'm going to call it uh, download this file PDF. Okay, I don't need to put a caption in there. Um, I'm going to select the media file. I don't want to link it to anything else, so it's going to link it directly to that file. I put that in there that, like that. And then when I look at the visual editor, you'll see there, download this file. That's how easy it is. It's really simple. Okay. Now the final media thing you might want to add to a, a post or a page is you might want to add a video. Okay, so here um, I've added a video from Vimeo. Okay, but what you'll find is a lot of themes will have this section here called embed code, and you can just put the YouTube video or whatever in there, and it'll automatically create that uh, that uh, video to sit perfectly on your site, and you won't have to worry about the parameters of the height and width because it automatically does everything for you. So here I've got one actually inside the post but I've also got it as a header. So I'm going to publish this for a second. So we're going to look at this now and you'll notice that the video is perfectly placed up there. You've got I've got the image on the right hand side. I've got the downloadable file. I've got the other video the video embedded inside the page as well. I've got all these other things that I've, all these other samples that I've done as well. But there you go. Okay, so that's how you embed media and uh, add media to a post or a page. Uh, it works the same for both pages and posts.